I was born with a hole in my heart. Sylvester Stallone's daughter, Sophia, is opening up about her heart condition. On Wednesday's episode of their reality show, The Family Stallone, the 26-year-old revealed she was born with a hole in her heart. In the Candid episode, she told her younger sister, Sistany, that she got really sick when she was two months old, and doctors originally had no idea what was wrong with her. Sophia's mom, Jennifer Flavin, eventually found a doctor that found the hole in her heart, and she was able to undergo a surgery. After living a normal life for several years, when she was 16, she fainted while playing volleyball. It's really scary having to go from living this normal life when I was 16 to having to have my chest sawed open. The moment I found out I needed an operation was one of the most pivotal experiences of my entire life because I never had to consider death before. I think what was really hard during that time was, like, mom was, it rashes all over her body. The best thing for you is just to relax. Dad couldn't even talk to me without, like, crying about it. She went on to say that was a very hard time in the family's life, revealing her mom got, quote, rashes all over her body, and her dad couldn't even look at her without crying about it. It's, re I'm, it's really traumatizing when you see the people that you think are gonna be, like the ones that should be like, you're gonna be 100% fine, like break down harder than you were. My dad and I never really had any conversation over my heart surgery because he really just didn't know how to deal with it. Since then, the model admitted it's been hard to talk to her dad about it because he, quote, didn't know how to deal with it. But the two were able to have a heart-to-heart -heart conversation about it when she visited him in Oklahoma. And during a private confessional, the Tulsa King star said his daughter was brave because she was able to put on a, quote, brave face while they were, quote, falling apart and scared to death. I think also the, the overwhelming amount of uh, stress I get on this is PTSD from when I was 16 and my second operation. Man, that was devastating. Yeah. Jesus Christ, it was horrible. And she was so brave. I mean, we're falling apart, and she put it on the brave face, and I know she's scared to death. I don't think I ever told you this, but I remember the day I found out that I had to have surgery. Mom broke down, you broke down, and everyone around me lost it. That was the moment I realized that sometimes the strongest people in your life aren't always as strong as you think, mm. you know? And I felt like I had to hold it together, so I don't even think you noticed. I didn't cry or worry about my heart surgery right. until the actual day when everyone left the room and I was alone. And then I felt like I could break down because I thought if I lose it, that we would all fall. When Sophia went to her annual checkup on the show, a doctor told her that her hole in her heart is still in place and that she is doing great. As seen in the latest episode of the reality show, the Stallone family always has each other's back. When Access Hollywood spoke to Sylvester and his family in May, they played a round of Stallone's Uncensored, and the Rocky star admitted the hardest part of seeing his girls grow up. The name of the game is Stallone's Uncensored. Get it? Got it. Girls, what was your earliest memory of me as your father? Ooh, earliest memory? Time's up. Thank you. Next question. <laughs> I think for me, what? one of the earliest memories is literally when I was like, I don't give two years old, and he put a golf club in my hand. I just like remember you handing me this giant, giant thing. Very good. Out in the you're backyard. Right. And I can't remember right. what it was, but it was I don't it was know, but you're club. swinging. You're still Yeah, good. exactly. You? Um, when you made me read like a poem, you're filming it, and you're on that old recorder, and then you'd replay it, and you're like, you didn't pronounce that word correctly. Oh. <laughs> That's your earliest <laughs> It was so, from so long ago. Oh, God. I don't Such know. fine memories. Mm -hmm. My earliest memory was... A tape recorder was... and a golf club. <laughs> yeah, maybe this morning. This morning? Yeah, that's my earliest I don't know. Your fondest memory is you sitting in the tree going... No, earliest, right? Oh, earliest. Oh, that was a cute photo. Oh, when, you were, just, what? oh, when you were sitting in the tree with him. Oh, yeah, I remember that. You put me in a tree and you left me up there. That's right. <laughs> it was beautiful. Who is the peacemaker in the family? Mom. Dad. Dad, dad oh. no, Mom, no. Dad, yes. I think Dad. I don't know, sometimes Can you believe it'd be that? both. I think both sometimes. Rambo yeah. is the peacemaker. Definitely both. I think both. an idea yeah, how tough then. she is. Mm -hmm. All right, I'll ask a question. Go for it. Out of us girls, who's dad's favorite? Now, this is a trick question. Ooh. It's a trick question because I'm the every single day, it changes. He says, I have a new favorite. So, who's the favorite today? So, yeah, who's today? <laughs> who's the favorite? Be honest. Don't be honest. say me. Don't, don't say, say me. Billy. Don't say Billy. No, no, you. 
no, what? no. Oh, out of, out, of oh out of them? I'm not saying that. Are you crazy? I'm no, you do won't. It. Do, do, it. do it today. Are oh, you armed? Anybody armed? <laughs> okay, my favorite today is. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, you can't. That's me. Do it. Come on. Oh, I'm, I'm taking the fifth. No, no. All right. No, there is no chance. He I'm he answering. He looked, we all looked at him like this. Is it my oh, turn? They're all like this. I know. Like, like, pick me. Pick me. <laughs> Billy. I was so sure he said Scarlett. Go. Got his daughter, Billy. Okay. Okay. No, this is. I love this question, Dad. Which of us had the worst ex-boyfriend? <gasps> oh, that's. I already know it's. Oh you're man, say. without a doubt, it's you. <laughs> Sistine. I mean, my Sistine. God. Is it one or multiple? multiple. Jesus, I like take them out and drown them like puppies. <laughs> oh my God! Like every one of them. <laughs> Not like a. Sorry, it didn't mean that. Sorry, I'm just... She just hit me when you like said. Like walruses. Oh, that, that, Dad, just, just answer the question. Answer. Just answer the question. Oh, it's Sistine. An... It's Sistine. It's Sistine. Oh, yeah. I thought you were going to say... No. Wait, no, it's Sistine's one. Are you kidding? It's Sistine. Um, okay. <laughs> Who in the family has the best fashion sense? I actually do have to say this thing. I think you have the longest running best fashion sense. Like, every single generation, like, she's seriously killed it from her 20s, her 30s, 40s, until now. But right now... Until now. <laughs> no, until now here. Until today. No, until, no, until now here. Until she bought know. this what sack. What are you wearing? What are you wearing? This little feed <laughs> bag over here. No, I mean, until, sorry, not now here. Sistine does out of three of us. Yeah, yeah. yeah. definitely. Yeah. But I'm great. No, but we all dress for our own fashion, but she's like the quickest to put together. So, Scarlett, you dress like a lot of times in like. She lives in Miami. Wait a baggy You're not pants. supposed to answer back. Just yeah, okay, it. go. Okay, You're okay. Done. Sly. Yes. I said on the show that mm -hmm. I still get butterflies when I see you. Aww. Yes. Do you still get butterflies when you see me? Why are you so shy to ask him? I get. <laughs> <laughs> I get buzzards. Oh, he gets the buzzards. That's I good. Get I'll giant take buzzards. Buzzards. How about, how about, what are those big butterflies called? Like, not a moth? Moths? moths? Yeah, moths. Yeah, okay, moths. Not a moth. <laughs> big butterflies. <laughs> you mean bats? Yeah, bats. I get bats when I, I see you. I get Oh my god. I get batty when I, I see you. I get batty. I get batty when I see you. We call her Flappy Bird because she's Wait, I have a question. Jennifer, when yes. was the moment you knew you were falling in love with me? Was it love at first sight? Uh, love at first bite. I don't know. I, I think yeah. it wasn't love at first. I, I mm. fell in love with your sense of humor when I first met you because you were really funny and you just took control of everything and I love that about you. Leave it but, at that. No, but my first time is when, how much you cared for me. Like you, but when? You were so, when I was 20. So. <laughs> she meant 25. <laughs> she's, she's always been bad at math. Okay, thank you, Sarah. <laughs> Moving on. Okay. It's my turn. Oh, it's my turn. All right. Dad, <laughs> Dad, what yes. has been the hardest part about seeing us grow up? Actually, the hardest part of seeing you grow up is seeing you grow up. That's what Leaving I'm... home. That's yeah. the worst. Exactly. I didn't talk to them for two months. Yeah, she was very upset. Yeah. What's, what's your It's answer? horrible. It's not your question, lady. Oh. <laughs> the hardest part was just, uh, you can't, you know, if you want to get philosophical about it and physical about it, it's like when you realize, oh, that moment's gone, that birthday's gone, that graduation is gone, and you weren't there. Mm -hmm. uh, you were not in the moment. And you go, God damn. And you can't get that back. So you sit, <laughs> you look at these old home movies, and you mm -hmm. go, God damn. That kind of thing. So that that's a real issue. Yeah. So can we somehow reverse engineer you can into Can you go to the prom again? Oh, the yeah. diapers again? Yeah, put my wedding dress on that you put, gave me for prom.